Okay. So this is creepy looking. Oh yeah. Okay. Um. Hmm. Okay. So it's, <laughs> this is called the colonies reduced. Um. This is propaganda. 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 Um. Which we're gonna be hitting propaganda hard. Yeah. Um. It's basically something to show. You disagree with something, and it's trying to get people riled up. All right, so this is a Ben Franklin uh, thing. You know, he's the one that did, which I think you can see, the Joiner Die Snake. He did that. This is his as well. And this is showing Lady Britannica, a.k.a. England, sitting there with her arms and legs cut off. The reason for that is it's showing that she used to be powerful. You see that shield. You see that spear over here. Well, now that she's ticking off her colonies, which are her limbs that give her power, she's hurting herself by ca causing all these taxes. So basically, the, the colonies begin to be divided mm -hmm. from the whole country. Right. From the whole idea of, you know, everybody being one, now people are starting to be divided. Exactly. And this is going to probably lead to something later hmm, on, right? Maybe. It's called the road to something, right? The road to something. Yeah. So Ben Franklin is hinting. He's saying, England, you better watch it because you're cutting off your own power. Yeah. Because how do countries get power? Through colonies. Oh, All right. Col colonization. That's a whole yeah. system. And so, so the mother country is going to be at a loss here because of everything that she's doing to actually um, get back at the colonists or to make them pay, you know, for right. the war debt or finally enforcing laws whenever, you know, before now they had solitary neglect. And the colonists are not going to take that lightly. No. They're not. No. And... Think about the um with when we had the joiner die snake that was the prepare for the Albany Plan of Union. This is preparing for another meeting, which is called the Stamp Act Congress. And first of all, I need to make sure you understand this. Write this in your notes. A Congress is just a meeting. Yeah, the right. word Congress means meeting. So if you all had a problem with Miss Lee and you all met outside of school to talk about her, it yeah, could be the Miss Lee Congress. <laughs> so there you go. Um, so. Um, they have two big things they do with this one. Um, they boy they decide they're going to boycott. So boycott, economic form of protest. Basically, you're going to say, I'm not buying this stuff. Mm -hmm. All right. If everyone hated the school lunches and everyone in the school boycotted and didn't buy the lunches, I guarantee you the lunches are going to change. <laughs> Seriously. Because that's going to hurt the school because they're going to have all that food sitting there rotting. It's so kind of like what, what the kids kind of did. Um, when it came down to like the dress code, mm -hmm. kinda, you know, they kind of did like their own little mini boycott a few yeah. years ago, and then they did like a petition, which is a letter of complaint, yep. and all of that led to change. And so this is what you see the colonists actually do: come right. together, have a meeting, um, boycott certain things, say, "Hey, I don't want to participate in that," or "I don't want to do that," um, and then petition, like drop drop a letter of complaint to show that they are very serious about getting rid of something that doesn't benefit them. Right. Right. And um, this is super important. You see on the bottom here, this is the first time the colonies successfully worked together. We had the Albany Plan of Union. They all tried and they disagreed on lots of different things and it didn't work out. This is the first time they come together and they work together. Yeah. It's not every single colony. I think it was like nine of them, I think. Um, but a group of them are coming together who usually wouldn't work together. Right. And part of the reason they're going to start working together, this all, all this connects together. We had the Great Awakening. We had the Enlightenment. All these things are making us yeah, kind of have common experiences yeah, yeah. and start thinking Thank for ourselves. Yeah. So all these things come together. These are not like weird history facts. All right. like they all come together. And so. you do have delegates from very strict colonies who say, I don't want any part in that. I want to remain loyal to the king. Mm -hmm. Or you have people like James Oglethorpe down in Georgia who basically say, hey, we're not going to send a representative because we're doing right. our own thing anyway. And we're trying to re rehabilitate these ex-cons and debtors. And, and even, with the, uh, even with the join or die... George is not on there because they were they were even considered a colony. They were like you know the little just a throwaway state. Yeah, <laughs> really. I mean that's what they were. So the buffer state. <laughs> yeah. So um, other responses. Um, we this is where we get a little fun, violent, revenge oh, colonist style. Oh um, lord! Look at that big old chicken there. What's oh, up with that? Well, you know, in order for the colonists to, to actually um, how can I say have revenge or to boycott mm -hmm. um, these taxes, they begin to tar and feather the tax collectors. And just think about somebody dipping you in some hot tar and rolling you in feathers. That is gruesome. Yeah. I mean, and just when we say hot them. tar, like yeah. you think of a hot glue gun. Yeah. Oh. Mm. Like this, is like a gallon of hot glue. Not a gallon, like yeah. big old thing of hot glue being poured on your entire body. Think about the burns. I mean, the burns on you, man. Yeah, third, fourth, fifth, and sixth. <laughs> They're getting all of it. Yeah. So, and then here, they and the, you can see in this picture, that's the Stamp Act to sign for it. They flipped it upside down during the protest. Yeah. And we'll get to these guys a little bit later who are pouring some stuff in the harbor. But they're actually pouring hot tea in his mouth as well. Like, it wasn't bad enough externally. Now they're going to pour hot liquids inside him. Mm. Like, this is... Mm. 
this is violent. I mean, where these are violent tears? protests. Where are his tears? I know it hurts. <laughs> Man, he can't even cry anymore. All, the, mm. All right. Um, and here's another one showing some tar and feathering going on. Um, gruesome stuff. Gruesome stuff. Uh, and here we've got another picture of them actually burning the stamps. This is in, this is so smart. I wish I was as smart to think of things like this. <laughs> so if you don't want anyone else to pay the taxes, oh, and by the way, those are tax collectors. They were right. doing that too to make sure that they would know I better not collect taxes anymore, mm -hmm. or else people are gonna they almost kill me. Mm -hmm. Here, these geniuses went into these warehouses and burned all the stamps. I don't blame them because I wouldn't want to be caught in tarred and feathered. So yeah. hey, if you can't beat them, might as well join them. Yep. Um, and, and the colonists would do this. They'd go in yeah, and burn all the stamps, stamps because if they do that, no one can pay it. Right. So it's, I mean, it's hurting England even more then. So genius. This would be going to all the post office and burning all the stamps today. No one yeah. could send letters, even yeah. if they wanted to. Even the loyalists couldn't mm -hmm. do it. So genius. These guys are, they're smart. Smart cookies.